We all know the trees now get a volume when you're using the storage containers right here, but I'm curious if you put a shorter piece than what is needed in here if you get a reduction in the volume. And I'm also curious what happens if I put like an eight meter log here in a six meter container. That's what we're gonna find out. I've got three, well, a bunch of trees, but I'm gonna cut down three trees right here. The first tree, I'm gonna cut into four meter segments and I'm gonna cut them into six. So six times four is 24. The next one, I'm gonna cut into six meter sections and that's gonna be four of them, 24 meters again. And then the third one, I'm gonna cut them into eight meter sections and that's only gonna be three segments at 24 meters. So all three trees, I'm gonna use the bottom 24 meters of the tree, we're gonna put them into three separate containers over here, the yellow, the red, and the green. And then I'm gonna see if there's a difference in the volume. This is the first tree. And what I'm gonna do is go ahead and lower this header down as far as I can right there. We're gonna go ahead and cut the tree, boom. Okay, I'm gonna swing it over and I am gonna go ahead and start making four meter sections right here. You can see that they are gonna be very, very short. There's one, here's two. All right, number three, number four, number five, and then number six right here. Now this extra piece, I'm just gonna take it up over here. I'm gonna get it out of the way. That way I can see if all of them are uh, exactly the same. So I'm gonna put it on max. It's gonna run all the way through. All right, so the next one here, I'm gonna go ahead and set my harvester to six meters now right there and let's go ahead and get over here and get started on this one once again lower my header all the way down as far as it'll go cut all right perfect raise up swing over we got it on six meters right now those are just going to go right here all right so there's one here's two all right number three and then here's number four Once again, I'm gonna set this to max. We're gonna swing this around. I'm gonna put this one right here. Tree number three, header all the way down. Header cutter is set at eight. We're gonna go ahead and just put those right over here. Gonna raise it up a little bit and boom. Here's number one. Here's number two. And here's number three. I'm gonna go ahead and put this log right over here, set this on max, and there we go. All right, so this log right here was our uh, one that we had everything on eight. This one here is the one that we had everything on six. So what I'm gonna do is go ahead and lift this up and place it right next to it here. These should be the same length, all right? And now this one here was the one that we had whenever it was on four. Let's put it up right next to it. Now, if we go to the other end, that's how much of a difference we should have. And yeah, yeah. So those trees cut exactly the same amount in the different stacks. This is fours, this is eights, and this is sixes. Now it's time to go ahead and throw them into the containers. All right, in the yellow container, we're gonna go ahead and throw the fours right here. I'm gonna try and do this as quick as possible. I don't want there to be any cuts in this video so you guys can see that I'm not doing anything funny here. So we're gonna go ahead and keep loading in all of these. And sorry, once again, this um, should be, <laughs> I typically try and do a little bit shorter videos, but I wanted it to be no cuts here. So there was no question as to what I actually did here in this video. All right, now I'm not gonna look at the volume. I'm just gonna go boom, we're gonna close it up. This one here is gonna be sixes. So that's gonna be these back over here. All right, so let's go ahead and get number one in here. All right, I'm gonna keep going over here. I'm just gonna go ahead and grab another one. All right, keep going into that one. Once again, sorry, this is a, a little bit longer video, but I wanted to make sure to do this with no cuts in here so you guys could see exactly what happened and that there was no funny business I'm, I'm gonna reiterate that a couple more times here because this is not one of my typical videos here all right so that one is done now we're closing that up I'm gonna go to this one and now i'm gonna go ahead and grab these eight meter sections and go ahead and throw that in this one maybe yep there we go all right so you see we get the message again that it's too long 
Now, this is going to be piece number two. Okay, and here is piece number three. Now, each of these were exactly 24 meters. All right, so I've got 5860 on this one. I've got 5834 and 5768. So, what about 80 liters difference there? That's that's interesting. These these aren't that bad. I mean, that could be like the where I cut it on the bottom, but this right here, I don't know. I mean, you're, you're talking so minuscule. I really don't think there's a difference. You know, and another really interesting tree here that I didn't even think about originally about putting in these containers is the American Elm. Now, this is an 18.7 meter log. Let's go and run the same test, but this time it's going to take too long to cut, so I'm not going to do it that way. I'm going to cut it, make the pile, and then I'll be back. So I went ahead and cut down two American Elm trees right here. These things were growing all the way to 18.7 meters. That's pretty big for this map. I've actually only found about three of them on the map. First thing I did was I threw one of them whole into this container right here. 92.89 is the volume. Now I'm going to go ahead and throw the next one into right here. And I've already cut this whole thing up into what I feel is the straightest pieces that I could. Now this tree comes in a pretty gnarly state, but we're going to go ahead and throw this into here and see how much total volume I can get on this uh, whole tree that I've cut it up myself. Now I'm hoping that it's closer to about 10,000, but if it's not, then we know that the, um, the container here does not uh, lose anything or doesn't give you a penalty on the volume whenever you put a whole tree in there. That's the test here. So let me go ahead and get all of this in here and I'll be right back and show you guys the total. All right, and here is the last piece going in here and the total is 9567 versus 9289. These were the exact same tree. I'm gonna go ahead and cut down one more tree here just to confirm this is exactly is the same so we're gonna get it down as low as i can right here we're gonna cut it i've got super strength on i'm on the pc so then i'm just gonna take the entire tree over put it into that blue container and see what that value is so there we go i've got the tree coming this way that way you guys can see everything that i'm doing here all right and i'm just gonna go right here and 9305 verse 9289 so i feel that's pretty close because of the way you know the bottom of the tree where you're cutting it at so i don't know why this one here is getting 9567 that, that's very very interesting to me so it appears that you're not getting a reduction in the volume there's just some other really interesting math going on in the coding of the game here that's causing those prices to be a little bit lower whenever you put the wrong size log in here so a little bit more testing is needed